How to find clients to make stencil art today in 2018? I'm sharing knowledge. Hey, my name is Ayan. How you doing? And I'm a visual artist who's making money by making wall stencils and mosaic art commission for the last 16 years. Well, there are two types of wall stencil art where you can make money. Selling stencil art on canvas, making paid wall stencils on place. We have talked about this already. If still, if you still haven't seen the video, go and check it out. I put a link in the description below. Well, the easiest way to sell stencil art is making stencils on canvas and try to sell them online. But it's also the most share your earnings position for an artist. If so, then I will ask you a question to prove your situation. Can your future clients find you, your stencils work on the internet, on similar artwork selling websites? Because this is the only way to sell your stencil work on canvas today. Number two, making paid wall stencils on place. Okay, this is how it will be look like. We will have a meeting today, I guess midday. Uh, talk about this at midday and I have also this and I'm gonna show him artworks of Louis Vane um, how we are gonna place them and stuff and uh, yeah you know that's a lot of work actually it's a lot of work to prepare stencils all these frames and stuff I guess it will be take two or three days maybe more but it will look fine so much colors it will be a multi-layer stencil preparation is the stage where the artist is able to make money working with interior designers house and property owners and builders and so on it doesn't matter if you want to make and sell the stencil art on canvas if you want to participate on large wall stencil art projects because both has almost the same selling technique today in 2002 i would say go out on the streets to find some clients and turn your stencil skills into money because no one will come to you make appointments with companies like builders architects interior designers or property owners well i still recommend you to do that if you want to make money by catching up some good paid and cool looking stencil jobs a lot of spaces demands these kind of street taste in their concepts because sometimes you can be in the right time at the right place but this is not happening very often but what about today well things has changed a little bit time has changed really habits has changed too everybody is busy and no one really has the time to listen to our super ideas unfortunately I will come up with a few questions to you to cover the video title which seems might boring to you but it's the truth let me give you an example before we dive into the questions my wife is working in one of the biggest and well-known brands as a manager you probably know how the interviews like they are looking like you know the thing is how she get this job so she prepared her notes, dressed it very well, and went to the Fancy Glass Plaza on time. She entered the conference room, as she said, and no one was in there. Four large screens open, as she said, one after another. Her interviews had started already, with four top managers from different continents online on the screen. So I'm sure you know already where this talk is going. My question for you are, do you have a website, at least a blog or a blogger on blogger? Are you writing articles about yourself as an artist? Do you present your stencils work on social media? Do you have a YouTube channel or do you post some footage showing how well you can do the stencils? The video thing is very important today because with this your future client will see how well you can execute the art. And more important than that is he will have or she will have a chance to know you. What kind of artist is he? Your behavior and body language. Just think simply like this. You are a good Formula 1 driver, but you will need at least a car to participate in the game, right? 
So today we must learn about the SEO thing. This will help you on getting noticed and will help your client to find the way to you. Believe or not, but everything is running online today. I never went to anywhere to have an interview about my work. Here is a sample about how it happens. First, you will receive an email saying, Hi, we have this wall and we wanted to ask if you are able to make this image on as a stance of work and how much it will cost. Then you will send them an email saying, Yes, I can do this for this price and you will send them your offer by email. It's all online. Then they will send you an advance payment. That's it. That's it. All the commissions I've made for the last five years happened exactly that way, like on the sample. Clients does not care about your out studio interior look today. They only care about your personality and your skills. And if the project is really big and your client will make sure that you will not run away before you finish the work, then they will ask you for your bank account data to make sure that you will spend the advance paid you by the client will getting spent on their project and not somewhere else. What is the main question laying behind the client's eyes? Is he or she really able to do the work? Is he or she able to listen to my suggestion? Is she or he able to do the work on time? Believe me when I say your client is taking a huge risk by letting you entering this job because he will get probably fired if you messed up. Especially in wall stencil art, you can't say, you know what, I will try to clean up the paint from the wall and I will start it from new. You can't. Painted is painted. There is no erase tool like on a computer. It's a real life situation. Well, if you was waiting for five tips about how to find clients and for your wall stencil business and grow fast, I'm sorry. I would say there are no tips in short term, but there are ways to build a strong basic stencil art career. You have to create a very strong online structure showing you making the wall stencil well or articles showing that you have knowledge in this field. You have made a, a few wall stencils already? Then go right now, take some good photos and video shots of it. Sit down and write articles about it. Include the photos that you have made. Share it on social media, load up the footage to YouTube, refer them to your website. Give the future client a chance to discover you. Because there is actually one rule in the art commission world, let him find you to rise up your value.